Hello everyone, uh, welcome back again, one more video and today I got 135 scale, okay, and it's a tank, it's, it's for us tankers, okay, and this one it's a very good model made by Zveda, and this is the German tank destroyer, okay, so this is not a normal tank, this is a German tank destroyer, so it's, it's made for destroy other tanks, and of course some, some walls, some fortress things, okay, and this is the Ferdinand and this is the HDKFZ 184 okay so this is a very good model to make this brings uh, 292 pieces and the length of this is 23.3 centimeters so this is a, a big one okay so if you want to build a very big one okay this is the one for you to build and as you can see, uh, this is not the box art, the box art is on the other side, this is a, a, a build it model uh, and this is it's very good build. Okay, so this is what you can achieve if you buy one of these models from Zveda. And of course you always can buy on Hobby, on, on Orchid store, it's a hobby kit. Uh, store you have to make this okay so if you have any questions just go to work it store uh, on or my Facebook and you can ask me the things and on this I can tell you what you need if the colors okay you got here the colors for umbrella for the colors I got the chart and I can tell you uh, if you are going to paint this with Vallejo with Miguel Jimenez okay or, or Itamia, so that is the, 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 the brands I got on my store and I think that is what we need, okay? If you want to build a, a thing with uh, with the, uh, weathering, strong weathering, you can go with the Vallejo and then you go with the weathering with acrylics, okay? But if you don't like acrylics, I go and say to go with Mig Jimenez, right? And with the Mia, it's a lot different. It's uh, to have this uh, kit more clean. Okay, I know there are lots of guys don't like to put a, a, a very a, a weathering very strong. So if you want this, like it's have on a museum, just go with the Mia. Okay, but for me, always it's Vallejo, uh, and I use the acrylics uh, weathering for this and. The good thing on that, it's very quickly to do this. So let's let's talk and let's try and start showing uh, what you can expect on the inside of this fantastic uh, kit from Zveda. This is the one that I'm going to build. Definitely, I love uh, Zveda models. So let's grab. I got here the box, so I'm going to open and I'm going to show you one by one these ones okay so we got here uh, okay focus we got here the body of the, the main tank okay and this is very good on the details we got here this open okay this is a plate to to close and as you can see it's not big on details but it's very good and at the end you are going to see it's an awesome kit to build okay so we got here uh, three big okay three big um, sprues and as you can see very nice we got here the side skirts on one side we got some parts of the top the two side skirts okay uh, we got here more things and now I'm going to show you up close guys to see you can see here uh, The details it's really good really really good. Okay here even here. I'm going to rotate this one These big bits here so good so good so good so good Okay, so one let's go and oh, and show you another one 
and I don't see the barrel how it came so let's see the barrel how it came so we got some parts here of the barrel uh, we got the loads of tiny parts uh, yeah. the detail is the jack here uh, here we got the front of the little barrel the nozzle and I think it's good Okay, even these ones, they are really, really nice. Here's the support for the, the gun barrel too. We got here some tools and yeah. I like it so far, I like it. So more things, okay. We got here some of the sides. So this is, this don't bring any interior for this model. And of course we got here, uh, it's made uh, a cable and it's different how it came, sorry, yeah, <laughs> the cables it came on this, you can see, so we just put and glue and it stays on the side, so we got here some of the edges, yeah, and a nice, it's nice the details, so now I got some good news for these ones, for the, the guys, so we got here two equal screws. Okay, I'm going to put one aside. It's the you can see, and they are very good. Some of the hooks, and yeah, and they are very simple to build. You got this one where you're going to put on this one, and we got the idler and the sprocket wheel, real easy to build. Now the main wheels. Okay, it's three sprues as you can see and we got here some, some parts of the, the springs and uh, guys look at the wheels, the wheels have the details we need okay for bringing up these ones and you can see on this little tiny one so it's so fantastic it's very good so three even sprockets now the guys were waiting it's this okay as you can see here it came on sections it's two screws and the tracks it came like this so this is very good we got here the screws even this one have the sag we need okay it's a, we have a little one so very nice so we got this on sections so you just go and lose some parts to make the curvatures around the idler and the sprocket wheel so this is not, not going to be a headache for some of you guys. <laughs> I know what I'm saying. So on this bag, it brings clear parts, okay, for the periscopes. And finally, we got here the decals. And they are nice, indeed. Okay. So I like the decals from, so from this, from these guys, they are really good, okay, so I always said on the videos and um, if you when you are going to put the decals guys don't forget put gloss varnish even if you don't want to to put the gloss varnish uh, uh, on all over your model just put on the on the places you are going to put the decals okay you put one coat and then when it's dry completely dry the decals just put another coat of the gloss on the top and you are not going to see the silvering so that it's very important what I am saying and I use that method for many times and, and a very long time uh, in years and I always 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 use uh, from Vallejo uh, I got here it's the, the gloss varnish I always use for because of the decals and then later I got here I use the solution, the decal fix for putting and the decal soft for softener the um, my decal. So let's see what you can get on the inside of this. Before I'm going to put your uh, sorry this on the box. I want this to stay safe. So guys, if you would like to buy this one, just go on Obi Kids. On work it store and you can buy this is online or even you can go on my store and you can talk with me and you can show what I got there okay so 
so instructions let's open these and as you can see one two three four five six seven and and it's rings on the the grids okay you got the grid on the inside of that little uh, little bag when it brings the the, the, the the clear parts okay so you can see the build the build it's it's really easy guys this these kits are made believe it these kits are made for beginners okay you will think this is so complex it's not it's uh, like the old kit from Tamiya okay I love kit from Tamiya because they are very easy to build and Veda I think it's more uh, the, the the last one the last kit from Veda it's even more easy to build okay and the, the good thing on that you build an awesome kit so you can see how it goes you can see here uh, all these ones and they don't put the number of the, the, the links you are going to need normally all, every brand always missing one or you got one more on this but here they put this on the way you can count and normally this is going to be really good okay don't forget the part like this one it's you have the sag okay on the bringing on this the Heidler wheel okay so you can see you put uh, there you guys you're going to put this uh, these little hooks here on the front they are from snap you can you can paint these aside put later and you got movements on these hooks okay uh, you, you can see here on the inside you got a little of the the gun so it's good if you leave the edge open and you put some figures on these and this is very easy to build guys very 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 easy to build so we are talking about yeah 16 steps for building this one so it's very very easy and you can see all I talk about the tool cable it's easy you got you just put there and it's solved the problem even the nozzle of the gun barrel it's very easy so now let's see you got the version to put to put two versions on this one the one uh, five months and one and one and two and you got another with the 612 okay so you can build this once uh, you just go and see the historical thing or you just build like this the colors you are going to need it's very easy it's the tank gray the white desert yellow natural wood US light green okay but if you have any questions about the colors okay this brings umbro and whether I can tell you the colors I need normally I use a set from uh, Vallejo to paint this one and but you can go with the brand you like it okay so my friends you got two versions to build this one okay the versions with the, the gun barrel seal or, or not okay so it's like you want 172 scale the number of this kit it's the 3653 so it's a very new one and guys believe it very 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 good so you are going to see me on the future building uh, this awesome kit okay so here it is Ferdinand SD KFC 184 awesome kit guys to build don't forget uh, if you have any questions just ask me okay and we talk later bye guys